Data mine grab bag for June seventh. Oh, sorry, seventh. Upcoming events: book five midpoint quests, three orbs, one thousand hero feathers, fifty heroic rails, forty-five secret coins, hundred twenty divine codes. Part two: five star Tatiana, five star Tatiana. I, I still can't believe we're getting two five star Tatianas. And minor rewards. Which, by the way, remember in the actual um, newsletter, they were like crystals. No, they're just minor rewards. No one actually cares. Come on. Yeah, but come on. Yeah, right. Yeah. Runs Ooh. through until the 20th. Ooh. So the next two weeks is actually a good time for a lot of people to return to heroes if you so are inclined. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Serpents Whisperers quests? It's just the main That's story. That's the book chapter. Ah, I was hoping for something extra. Five orbs. It's a cool name, though. Forging bonds the site of future with Valentin Pala, Luthier, Tatiana, and Zeke runs through until the 21st. So we are in fact getting four tickets. So it is in fact 135 orbs to spark. Yep. I actually don't suggest that though. I think you should wait on Luthier. But uh, yeah, you got the options. I would. Uh, so to be clear, this is what I would do. All the tickets, faux poles. But afterwards, I'd start sniping. I do not have orb leniency to do that. <laughs> Uh, okay. I'm doing it exactly to the limit. Yeah, you, yeah, you, you're trying to conserve as many orbs as possible. Okay. GHB Fernand runs through until the 16th. We've talked about Fernand. He is here. Here. There you go. On the 10th, Fate Pass Quest, Fate Pass Exclusive, aka it is Krom. Welcome, Krom. He's rewards. Yep. Mirror Strike Shield Phase hey. versus Male Kana. Not really matter. <laughs> Red Battle Quest, four orbs and minor rewards. Yay, orbs, four orbs. Angry Kana noises in the background. Wait, how do we get more orbs from the Red Battle Quest in the celebration? <laughs> uh, free summons. Ah, yes, <laughs> please. Uh, That's true, 13 free summons. Additionally, let me hear about quests featuring GHB, uh, let them hear battles featuring GHB Iago, Tibar, and Kanigas. And to Kanigas, GHP Ashnard, BHP Innis, and Erica, and MHP Naga. Nagas is one of the harder ones, so good luck with that. Okay. Uh, Hall Forms with Winter Fay, Summer Lilna, Brenya, and Lor Oh, wait, this is Hall Forms. Winter Fay. Yep. She was free. That was already <laughs> yeah. Huh. Interesting. Saviors can be in there, so uh, Winter Fay can be used as a save unit. Wait, what the heck is this theme? Summer Winter Fay, Summer Lilna. Um, it's FE6. Yeah, FE6. With winter and summer units side by side. I, yeah. It's hot. I guess, I guess we're doing that. Oh, sorry. We're yeah, the I red. think a lot of people are going to be tempted for uh, yes. getting Brunya. Yeah, but Brunya builds are not that expensive, I would say. Usually uh, double solo um, with lol or null fall up is really all you need. That's still uh, pretty expensive, and you usually right. want like Paul Smoke or something like that. The, actually, Bronya basically needs a whole new kit. She's probably one of the more expensive units to build. Yeah, and you'd save and a it saves five hundred grails. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna say that for Bronya, it might be worth it. But on, honestly, I think Bronya's fallen off. I've I don't. eaten multiple <laughs> plus ten Bronyas this week, literally multiple, completely max summoner supported. Uh, she has looked very pedestrian. Um, if people still want to go for it, how old is she at this point? Um, a little more than a year. What? Away? More than a year? I thought she was um, twenty nineteen, right? Well, that's technically now. That's more like two years ago. Yeah, or because she was like end of twenty nineteen. Okay, so, so a year and a half ago. Yeah. Uh, if I'm gonna recommend for anybody here. Unfortunately, you can't take. You would want to, but you shouldn't. You can take um, unity skills. I wouldn't do it. It just would not make a lot of sense. Yeah, you don't take that, Ambrunia. You're gonna want like solo or stance four mostly. Which is right. why I think this is kind of unfortunate. It's solo. You gotta take solo. She's a dual phase unit. Yeah. So I would look for like attack speed solo four, attack defense solo four, or any of the solo fours that you are more comfortable with. And then you would run the opposite solo. Or not the opposite solo, but something else to counter and balance there. So basically you're looking for speed and defense or speed and res is at the end of the day. Yep. Or attack and speed technically. Mm-hmm. 
So yeah, that's what I would look for. I would look for pulse smoke and I would look for null follow up or if you don't want null follow up lols, but I would take null follow up. Yeah. I, I like the lull, but no follow up is pretty absolute as well. Yeah. Anyways, so that's what I would look for. Brunya could be worth it. I am continue to save mine. I want to make a plus in Brunya at a certain point. And then I was just like, Brunya or Patrine? I made Patrine. And I. Brunya is more of an Ether Raid's offense unit, but if you're going to use her in Ether Raid's defense, it's Patrine. That's much more useful at this point. Right. They both target magic, uh, res, and they're both blue. So that's the reason. And they're both like threat range of four. So yeah, that's weird. But they were actually interviewing very close together when I was looking at which Ether Raid defense you're going to pick up. Anyways, that said, it runs until the 29th and form units available for purchase until the 13th. So yeah, it's going to be a while before we get our next uh, hall form. I mean, it's once a month, but yeah. BHB, Fallen Ike and Fallen Julia. Ah, uh, Ike and Julia. Yeah. That's a theme. That's not easy. You can't deb debuff Ike and Julia if well, you're that's... magical. Congratulations, you're screwed. Mm -hmm. Interesting. That might be a difficult battle. You know what? I'm looking forward to it because, again, we did get a really hard one. Uh, our, our goddess here kind of showed us what was up with double armor, double savior. Yeah, that was brutal. Granted, it was a mythic hero battle, but still still I, but that does like make me uh, look forward to the future of like some difficulties really yeah on's loki bonus physical units runs for two days now with 11 tiers right we got a new little theme of bob yes we have a platinum trophy now platinum okay i like that ghb revival george no Kyle. give me patrina already you bastards this is george you're making plus 10 george Here's your final George, who's bought it in. He doesn't even deserve to be here. At least he looks funny. Um, Hunter Hero Banner is at the 30th and runs until the 6th of July. Uh, BHB Revival, Lou and Rai, uh, they suck. We have daily quests until 20... Daily qu Oh, wait, of course we have daily quests. What am I talking about? Season will be on the 21st, which is pretty late. Uh, tactics drill, skill studies, Grandmaster, da da da, 300 feathers, 300 feathers. They said the AI changes change the drills up. Is that true? Yes, they had to readjust some of them. I haven't looked, but they had to readjust mm. to make sure that they worked. As it did before. Okay, makes sense. Resident Battle, bonus games. Tooker Mirage Sessions. Congratulations. No one's going to have units. I hope you like it, Ski. Right. And then Echoes. And then Heroes and then Binding Blade are next for Resident Battles. Uranus bonus units. Valentin Pala, Zeke, Tatiana, Luthier, Furnet. Everyone's going to have at least a plus one Tatiana. <laughs> nice. Yep. Luthia, Ferdinand, uh, Spring Sharina, Soth, Ledger, Marth, and Anna. I'm going to run Soth. I have a plus four Soth. All right. Uh, next for Ether Arena bonus units, it is um, the same. What am I talking about? It's Fire, Earth, Astro, Anima, and then Fire, Water, Light, and Dark. Fire, fire. Who's the scary fire, fire unit again? Ledger, uh, Anna, Lilina. Ledger, Lilina. Lilina. Okay. Okay, okay. And then afterwards, it is water, wind, astro. Hey, it's a triple that week. Mm. I Wait, mean, it's a Marth, triple week. First off, Marth is not bonus, but, huh? No, I'm oh, saying yeah. it's a triple. Three band yeah. yeah, three weeks of the same band. Oh, God. Anna, Anna, and Anna. That's going to suck. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to probably plus 10 Soph then, just to make sure I stay in all. Yeah. Yeah, it's it. Like you don't plus 10 Soph. Yeah, I'm, he's at plus four right now. That's why I think it might be worthwhile. Oh, and I, I didn't mention this before, but uh, Resident Battles are Echoes uh, next week, so that'll make things easier. I, I mean, we saw camera. that right here. No, no, but, no, I just wanted to say, but if you pull in this banner, you could get some... Oh, units. yeah, these are... Uh... It's really CMS weird. So I thought the Echoes was like the, the phrasing of it. Like, isn't it, should be, shouldn't it be Shrouds of Lentia? Uh, I, I thought Echoes was going to be like how they're going to introduce like these old remakes. Uh, technically, yeah, so. nothing is said that Echoes is going to get more. At yeah, least as far as so. I remember, Echoes is still technically a standalone title, but no. they could use it. Because I thought it was called Echoes because it's the Echoes of the past, like it's a past game. Being I thought it was a cl naming class. 
like a naming title thing. I thought so too, but I haven't. Nope. I don't remember exactly. I, I remember them saying something on the contrary, but it's been a while. So maybe it just randomly echoes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. Ether Junior raids Stay. Peony and Sothis. Congratulations! Everybody should have Peony. I have Sothis. <laughs> um, Harmonize Catria, Bride Shanna, Bride Juno, Bride Saul, Bride Groom, Zealots, Clive, Ledger Roy, and Fjorm. Okay. At least you have a lot of options there. Even use Clive. You're not going to use Clive. Um, you got next week Ashera Lif instead. Oh, she's already here. Yeah, note will be bonus starting on the 22nd. And then note is bonus. You, you got a lot of time then before you spark. But you got a lot of time to make it in, turn, in time for her to be a bonus unit. Yep. Uh, and then Mila and note. Uh, Dark Shrine, Bright Shrine, Flower School are your... Uh, options there fire wind light dark into fire earth astro anima into fire water light and dark great fires everywhere congratulations Zulnas. have fun okay new accessories tricolor charm a charm that belonged to pala tricolor charm ex mage bandana mage bandana ex saint circlet and then guilt helm and then platinum ponza trophy are now here which means we don't get feathers this week we get a trophy uh we do get feathers from the well i thought... actually I access. thought once it gets repeated, you get feathers. Uh, you get an extra 1,000 feathers because of the tier reward. Ooh, um, oh, the guild okay. helmets should be popular. People always love putting the helmets on random units. So. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, no. So, you can't access tier 11 on this season, by the way. Oh, good. Even though the season's technically started. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, new secret seals, squad ace AU1, squad ace AU2, attack res plus two. Uh, Golan Bursty enables cancel. Wait, what? 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 Is this? this is for enemies right now. Yeah, this is for the um, AI. Um, oh, Golan the Bursty. steam the same, soldier uh, steam things. Unit. Yeah, yeah. It's canton remainder on a seal. Oh, God damn it. That's right. They're all going to have cancel now. <laughs> yep. Which makes me wonder if, like, at the end of the story, we might get this as a player uh, skill because no. right now it's enemy only but it's not gonna like it's not gonna happen i don't think so probably not yeah all right uh new aether rates bonus structures bright shrine bright shrine use it i'm gonna upgrade it attack speed minus nine congratulations are you gonna have a good time here no you're not in the words of sans you're gonna have a bad time yeah if you run harsh command it's a plus nine buff all the while dagger and fall Knight are just like grinning <laughs> <laughs> yeah yep they love that all right, new items for sale. Some are Hellbending, some are Noir. We already talked about this. Hellbending, absolutely pick that up. If you're not picking up anybody else, even if you don't play Fey, uh, actually, if you don't play Fey, why are you here? Some are Hellbending, attack defense, uh, double rally for attack defense plus, and then of course, Red Duel uh, for infantries. But um, yeah, Noir, Felix, Keaton, we should be able to get all four of these, so that'd be good. Girl Shop, Sonia and Innis are here. Uh, we're gonna see a lot of Innis real soon, so be interesting. Yep. Not a whole lot of Sonya's, I'm guessing. Uh I like her a lot, but I God damn Leon's. Anyways, Past, Past Light is here and then Proud Commander is here. Um, accessory shop. Oh! Oh. No? I was what, really excited because I was hoping for I, I my brain said attack res form and then I, and then I woke up and realized oh, uh, attack defense form. I was just so excited. Forges, yeah. yeah. Uh, new special stages. Uh, um, okay, I guess we'll know. Uh, for Iago, it is Genealogic Holy War and Thracia 776. For Tibar and Kanigas, it is Echoes and Sha uh, Echoes and Echoes. It's just yes, Echoes. Echoes, yeah. <laughs> for Ashnard, it is Effie Heroes. And Limited Hero Battle for Innocent Erica will be Fates. For uh, Naga, it is the Binding Blade. Hey, cool. We got some anti dragon heroes that are red. Uh... We also have no dancers except for Laram. Oh, that's yeah. not going to be fun. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, it's Naga. <laughs> yeah. Good luck. I hope Roy has I fun here. I hate that map. <laughs> I hate that I feel map like the, so much. Well, the only other dancer we're going to get ever from Binding Blade is either like an alt of someone or um, or Elfin. Elfin. So, so yeah. until they demote Elfin, yeah, Binding Blade weeks are just going to suck. So. Good luck with that one. Okay, for those who are not at our data mine, here are your like skimps or uh, skimp. What? 
Whatever. The, the short end of the stick. Tiny PPs all around. Uh, Note has 40 HP, 41 attack, 40 speed, 28 defense, and 27 uh, res for 176 BST. Pallet has 41 HP, 42 attack, 21 speed, 41 defense, 28 res for 173 BST. Um, ah, damn it. I should do super goons too. Okay, it's attack speed, res, Banes, and HP and defense for Note. Uh, for Pallet, it is super boon and attack, Banes, and HP, defense, and res. For Luthier, uh, 43 HP, 37 attack, 36 speed, 20 defense, 30 res, 166 BST, no boons, no banes. Uh, Tatiana is um, 165 BST for 40 HP, 37 attack, 34 speed, 15 defense, and 39 res. Defense, res, super boons, super bane, and HP. Actually, that's a monstrous 43 res, whole crud. Uh, nice. Sabotage away. Zeke is 40 HP, 40 attack, 15 speed, 38 defense, 35 res, 168 BST. Um, third slowest unit in the game, super boons and speed. Congratulations if you want to take him from third slowest to fifth slowest or something. You could do that, I guess. Um, and defense. Yeah, and defense. That's much more valuable. 42 defense, 35 res. Oh, God. And super banes and HP and attack. Burnan, traitorous, traitorous knight is, uh, I guess that's a Polish title, but whatever. 45 HP, 41 yeah. attack, 26 defense, uh, 26 speed, 32 defense, 23 res. Super boon in attack and speed, super bane in nothing. Oh, attack speed and res. Actually, that's pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. Go for attack, yeah. obviously, if we're going to do that. Don't do that. He sucks. Uh, and and a new speed. <laughs> and speed. Don't worry about it. And finally, our new um, enemies, Steam Sword, Steam Lance, Steam Axe. Welcome to the game. They're all 160 ABST. Satheon powered mounted soldier with a blank. Yep. And upcoming banners. Double special heroes banner. Let's amend this real quick. Has harmonized Altina. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A little big. <laughs> okay. Did you ever want to yep. make a plus 10 harmonized Altina? You can now. You she want is to back. Fodder? Also an option. He's also of Ninja Navar. What? I thought Navar was already. Oh, no, he's not. But she shares with Halloween Dagens here. Oh, never mind. Yep. Halloween Dagens. Yeah, it was because it was the arc. Oh, God. It's so confusing. All right. Dagens has got great fodder. Halloween Dagens. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no. She's back. Yeah. Winter <laughs> Bernadetta. Terrible. Uh, Terrible. I need to pull for her so I can be cancer, too. And do a peony at the same time. That green color is one of the best green colors I've ever seen. I'm summoning. Okay, so what's happening now is I spark for this banner, Shadows of Luntia, the midpoint banner. And then afterwards, I'm going in here. The Winter Saffron is. Oh my god, what in the shit is this? I'm so Winter. upset. <laughs> this is so busted, chat. And then Winter Hill. Such a good banner. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, uh. All right, chat. So, um, I've already decided on which two banners I'm going for this month. Double, <laughs> heroes, double special heroes banner gets all my rem remaining orbs after uh, going for note. Oh, no, going crud. For um, Harmon Saltina needs no explanation. One of the highest attacking heroes in the entire game. Twin Blades is amazing. Um, she comes with a unity skill, attack res unity. I don't know what to say. This hero is so absurdly good. Even at no merges, she will carry the day for you. Uh, Halloween Gensia, one of the best dragons in the entire game. Actually, the tallest hero in the game. He is actually even taller than uh, Edelgard, who is floating, by the way, which is cheating, but he's still taller. <laughs> yep. Uh, and then, of course, Ninja Navar. I, I'm sorry, this doesn't matter. But he, he's good. But Dual Peony. Flashing Blade 4. Flashing Blade 4 fodder, there you go. Dual Peony uh, can add a shit ton of extra attack just by being in the same direction. This girl is ridiculous. Um, One night PST dancer with a perf dance. Yeah. And Dual Syndrance. And everyone can uh, teleport afterwards. Yeah, Dual Syndrance is really important. And then Winter Burner Zeta! Ha <laughs> everyone loses 1 HP. And you'd be like, oh, that's... Why would you want... No, it's it enables so much stuff. Etherate's defense, Winter Burner Zeta, makes you sad very quickly. Meta is her own meta. Yep. And Winter Seferin for uh just because we could use a C slot and make my goodness, this is how to make cancer ether raids defense team. Here you go, summon on this banner. At least it's not rescue or return. 
There's literally three of the heroes yep. that I think would really make another any team really annoying. Duo Peony, Winter Burn, uh, Winter Sephirim. Uh, well, him being fodder, but Duo Peony, Winter Burn, uh, and Harmonize Altina on defensive teams is still scary because some people just can't kill her. Mendigencia is just great fodder to any offensive process. Um, uh, can be used for like savior fodder as well. Um, savior tank fodders, like with Slick Fighter and Sturdy Three, so that's even more toxic. Yeah. Hey, Zay might be back. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what but... people would even care. Uh, actually, I should probably make the video on Zane. He's really, really good now. If you don't have one, you might as well get one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Crud, even a chance of plus in Winter Hilda. Oh my god. This banner might be amazing. Uh huh. A little bit. All right. Well, and that's your data mine. There you go. 